a company which embed its products in almost every computer in the world. Owning such range of software makes it so much powerful. Depending so much on single company raises some serious questions and can lead to disastrous effects in future. With course of time, from accused of trying to create a monopoly to several other allegations, Microsoft has been survived and evolved into world leader of computer technology. Want to know more about Microsoft? Then let's get started. Welcome to the Watch It Punk. Here you get a simplified knowledge on meaningful topics. Microsoft is an American multinational technology corporation which produces computer software, consumer electronics, personal computers, and related services. It is considered one of the big five companies in the U.S. information technology industry. Microsoft was founded by Bill Gates and Paul Allen on April 4, 1975 to develop and sell basic interpreters for the Altair 8800. Microsoft entered the operating system business in 1980 with its own version of Unix, called Xenix. But it was MS-DOS that solidified the company's dominance. IBM awarded a contract to Microsoft in November 1980 to provide a version of DOS to be used in the IBM personal computer. It rose to dominate the personal computer operating system market with MS-DOS in the mid-1980s, followed by Microsoft Windows. It released Microsoft Windows on November 20, 1985 as a graphical extension for MS-DOS. Bill Gates solidified the base of company and from here new era for Microsoft begin. Steve Ballmer replaced Gates as CEO in 2000 and later envisioned a devices and services strategy. This unfolded with Microsoft acquiring Danger Incorporation in 2008, entering the personal computer production market for the first time in June 2012 with the launch of the Microsoft Surface line of tablet computers and later forming Microsoft Mobile through the acquisition of Nokia. To catch the pace of new technology and meet the requirements of modern consumers, Ballmer handed over command of Microsoft to young talent and visionary Satya Nadella. Since Satya Nadella took over as CEO in 2014, the company has scaled back on hardware and has instead focused on cloud computing a move that helped the company's shares reach its highest value since December 1999. As of 2015, Microsoft was market dominant in the IBM PC compatible operating system market and the office suite market, although it has lost the majority of the overall operating system market to Android. The company also produces a wide range of other consumer and enterprise software for desktops, laptops, tabs, gadgets, and servers, including internet search, the digital services market through MSN, mixed reality with HoloLens, cloud computing with Azure, and software development with Visual Studio. Its best-known software products are the Microsoft Windows line of operating systems, the Microsoft Office Suite, and the Internet Explorer and Edge web browsers. Its flagship hardware products are the Xbox video game consoles and the Microsoft Surface lineup of touchscreen personal computers. One of the reason why Microsoft been famous around is the wealth it created for its founders. The company's 1986 initial public offering and subsequent rise in its share price created three billionaires and an estimated whopping 12,000 millionaires among Microsoft employees. Thanks to Microsoft, Bill Gates were on top of list of the world's richest person for more than two decades. Since the 1990s, it has increasingly diversified from the operating system market and has made a number of corporate acquisitions, their largest being the acquisition of LinkedIn for $26.2 billion in December 2016, followed by their acquisition of Skype Technologies for $8.5 billion in May 2011. Microsoft ranked number 21 in the 2020 Fortune 500 rankings of the largest United States corporations by total revenue. It was the world's largest software maker by revenue as of 2016. Earlier dethroned by Apple in 2010, rising back in 2018, Microsoft reclaimed its position as the most valuable publicly traded company in the world. In April 2019, Microsoft reached the trillion-dollar market capitalization, becoming the third U.S. public company to be valued at over $1 trillion after Apple and Amazon, respectively. As of 2020, Microsoft has the third highest global brand valuation. From starting in allegations to sitting on the top, Microsoft do have created monopoly through its windows. Well, but time ahead is not that easy. That's it for today. Please like the video and subscribe the channel if you find value in this video and comment down your views about Microsoft.